Daniel Hogg, let's start with the game situation. Tough day, long day out in the field, but what's the mood like in the dressing room? So the mood's very high mood, I'd say. Although it might have been a long day, I think we're still, we came out on top today. So yeah, we're just looking to get stuck right into them tomorrow morning. Yeah, brilliant game situation, well set up. Just had to be patient, didn't you? Yeah, just that was it. Just bashing at a length and then waiting for the pitch to do something or waiting for them to make a mistake. Let's talk about you. A wonderful day for you. Picked up your maiden first class wicket. Yeah. And then there was a nice moment actually for you. Yeah, real nice. Or well, like just nice to get get off the mark really. That's all all I was trying to do and then when it came, yeah, great moment. Got off the mark and then kept going. Did you feel like you were in really good rhythm? It looked like you were bowling beautifully this afternoon. Yeah, yeah, I just felt real good rhythm and then kind of that wicket, you know, it helps settle the nerves early on and then um, yeah, just found my length nicely and just kept bashing away. Three for 30. Might have been one more if Scott Borkwick could hold his catches. Uh, <laughs> it can happen. I won't, won't hold it against him. He caught, caught one in the end. So. <laughs> he did. How's the body holding up? You played a bit of multi-day cricket before, but the intensity of this. Yeah, I'd say body's definitely been better, but now I've got some recovery going on upstairs, so it should be nice and fresh for tomorrow morning. <laughs> How nice is it being part of the team? It looked to us like Ben Rain and Paul Coglin were around you, talking you through it all. That must be really helpful. Yeah, great having them around. Like, just help, like, set your plans. Them, like, the clear on what makes you. They're making sure I'm clear on what I want to do, and just like, you know, maybe, maybe ball a bad ball, get hit before, and then they just calm you down. No dramas, but yeah, great to be out there and like everyone's having fun as well while we're playing. So it's just great to be part of. Come back tomorrow morning. Jack Haynes is still out there. There was a moment where it looked like he might have been given out that catch that came off Graham Clark's foot. You guys felt it was out. Umpires said it wasn't. What was going on? What were the conversations happening out there? What did you feel? Uh, we all felt that it hit off like, Clarky's foot like without a bounce and then got caught by Parky. But then it's one of them decisions really where it's all happened so fast it's hard to tell what happened. Yeah, it does happen so quickly, and you're going to have a chilled out evening tonight ahead of a yeah, chilled out ball tomorrow. Evening, yeah, no plans tonight. <laughs> Magic. Sit on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Daniel. Cheers, thanks.